Pretty cool, let's do this in CapCut. Start with a new project and from the stock videos add a black video. Add the clip you want to use as an overlay. With the overlay selected, tap on cut out and then remove the background. CapCut will start removing the background and this may take a while. While CapCut is busy, I will remove the Made by CapCut clip at the end and extend the black layer to the same length of the clip with the man walking. Once the remove background is finished, make sure the clip is selected and tap on Adjust, followed by Graphs. With the white selected, move the top right node all the way to the left. We got a white silhouette which we will use to fill later. The edges are quite hard. To fix that, let's go back to the main timeline and tap on Effects. From the Lens section, let's use Blur and tap Apply. Extend the filter so it overlaps the whole duration. With the filter selected, tap on Object and select Overlay so the blur applies only to the white silhouette. The blur radius is a bit too much, so tap on Effect and choose Adjust. Lower it around a single digit value. We're going to add another overlay and this time choose the video that will be played inside the white area. Make sure the new video has the same duration and then finally tap on Blend. From the Blend option we can use Darken. This will clip the video inside the white area. If needed, do some keyframing to make sure the clip inside the man looks interesting. When finished we can export this. Awesome, the most difficult part is done. Let's create a new project, but this time let's start with our clip. We can now add the clip we just exported as an overlay. To make the black go away, tap on Blend and then select Lighten. Perfect, we get the effect we wanted. To make it a bit more interesting, let's add an effect to it. Go back to the main timeline, choose Effect and then Glitch. Select Color Glitch 2 and tap Apply. Make sure the effect has the same duration and tap on Object. In the Object, tap on Overlay so the effect only applies to the overlay. And our effect is done. Let's export and have a quick look at the final result. Pretty awesome. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.